If you go outside tonight and look up at the moon, you'll notice a bright red object really close to it. That object is the planet Mars. And for some of you, the moon is actually going to move over the planet Mars, covering it for a certain period of time. I'm Michael Martin, and this is Late Night Astronomy, your guide to the best objects, events, and equipment to help you go out to see and image the nighttime sky. This event is called an occultation, and it's a pretty remarkable thing that happens quite often in astronomy. It's when one object moves in front of another from our perspective and temporarily blocks the light from us being able to see it. Most of these events I've viewed over the years through the telescope involve the moon and a dim star, but tonight's event is a special one because it involves the moon and one of the brightest things in the night sky right now, Mars. Now, for everyone around the world, Mars will appear really close to the moon during the night of December 7th and early morning of December 8th. But for some of you located in this region of the world shown on this map, the moon will actually cover Mars for a short period of time. This is a time-sensitive event, and there's a really good website you can visit to tell you exactly when to go out to see this happen, and it's called inthesky.org. When you go to the link that I'll include in the description of this video, you can type your location in and the article will update all the information you need to know to go out and see the moon occult Mars from where you live. This event can be viewed with no equipment at all, but a pair of binoculars or a telescope will lead to some pretty incredible views of Mars being partially covered and then fully covered by the moon. Sadly, I won't get to see any part of the moon cover Mars from where I live on the East Coast. But if you're able to experience any part of this event, please let us know about your experience in the comment section below and tag me over on Instagram to share any pictures or videos that you're able to take. Thank you all so much for your continued support and clear skies from late night astronomy.